Now new at 5, B98.5's radio show host, Kelly Stevens, spoke on camera only to Channel 2 Action News. He says he'll never take life for granted after surviving a wrong way accident on Georgia 400. And new at 5, Channel 2's Craig Lucy reports after weeks of recovery, doctors may release Stevens from their care this week. Justin, doctors may let Kelly Stevens go home this coming Saturday, but he can't put any weight on the left side of his body for at least eight weeks after breaking his leg. He also has a broken arm, ribs, and vertebrae in an accident that he still has flashbacks about. I remember everything. I remember not only the, the sounds, the sights, the smell, the taste. I mean, you know, it's, it was just the most horrific thing to go through. Then. With his fiance Katie, by his side, Kelly Stevens took us back to the scene on August 24th, where police say 22-year-old Carlin Royball drove the wrong way on Georgia 400. That is the saddest part of this, is that somebody lost a life, and that is just, it's difficult to deal with. Steven says Roy Ball's father has reached out to him, but he gets too emotional to talk about their loss. I'm just going to wait until I'm a little stronger, a little better. And I know it's a tough time for them. I can't even imagine. What Stevens can imagine now is living with a new outlook on life. Yes, he has multiple broken bones and a shattered elbow, but he'll tell you this. Listen, I'm alive, and that's a miracle. And I'll have a chance at life again. One that he's looking forward to sharing with, with the woman who's been at his side throughout his recovery. We were feet away for one of the best moments in their lives. I love you. And I wanted to know if you would do me the honor of marrying, of marrying me. Because I give you this ring. Will you marry me, Katie? I'm the luckiest man in the world. Katie told us it's hard to believe that something so good would follow such a violent crash. And we'll show you what led up to that proposal on Channel 2 Action News at 6.